Dude, we can't hear you. Oh, that's my fault. Um, I never thought that I would have my own show. In fact, uh, oh, I never thought <laughs> that I would never have um, my own shows. Um, I never thought that, and 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 I'm very grateful for the opportunity. Somebody said, um, "I'm not. I am blocking in the comments because um, I don't have to lie. I'm known. I'm rich." I'm successful, um, I'm crazy, um, but I'm rich, um, and I'm successful, <laughs> and I'm known, I'm too known that I got you watching, I definitely ain't watching your stuff, that will never happen, um, so, take it however you want to take it, but get your plane tickets together, get your hotel bookings together, because your boy Andrew Caldwell is coming out with his own show, um, I can't, t I can't go into details, cause, you know, but I want you guys to definitely save up if you have to save up to come to St. Louis plan on. And I was, let me just say this and I meant every word of this and I meant this from my heart plan to come in September, please, please plan to come to St. Louis in September. Um, once my teasel and photo shoot come out, then you guys can start booking yourself, your hotels and stuff. So wait. Uh, but definitely plan to come to um, St. Louis, Missouri in September. So that's like three months. So and as you know, also, I'm running for office, um, which is continue to be a great success. We had a meeting last night, which was great success. And I told the people, they said, why are you running for office? And I said, well, I'm 30 years old. I grew up I grew up in this ward. And my goal is to help and encourage those to vote. My goal is to make sure safety is in our neighborhoods. And making sure our officers are coming in a timely manner. Making sure schools, students are given the education that they deserve. Making sure we have community ev events. Making sure that, uh, making sure everyone is aware when we have meetings. Making sure everyone is aware when it's time to vote. Encouraging those to vote. No matter who you vote for, no matter if you're a Republican, no matter if you're a Democrat, still vote. So I'm running for office, which is that's in August. Thank you to some of those that have been constantly donating to my campaign. You know who you are. You definitely will be invited to my birthday dinner um, as a thank you. I'm not buying you. <laughs> You're not buying me. Um, but look, be looking out for your um, invitation. My birthday dinner is coming out. And I am so excited about my 31st birthday dinner. It's coming out. It's in July. <laughs> um but I'm excited about that. But I'm also excited about, about my new show. And then also, as you know, I'm receiving a Lifetime Achievement Award. Which is by the President and Vice President of the United States of America. It's one of the highest honors that you can get in the world. And I am so happy for my 10 years of services. And you said, well, Andrew Caldwell, what have you done in 10 years of services? I gave back to the need. I fed the homeless. I paid my tithes. I made people laugh. I created both sides of hate and both sides of love. I know everybody on this live hate me. And I know some people on this live love me. I'm very aware of that. Um, I'm not bothered by your comments. I'm not bothered by you. Because this is just social media. And don't forget after I end this live, we still have to live a normal life. Um, if I chose to live it as a luxury lifestyle, I chose to live it. If I chose to live it as a grand or treat people nice, I chose to do that. So I'm not bothered by any of your negative comments. It feels good in my it feels good in my soul to block you. 
to know that your screen is no longer exist. To know that you have to create another page because you're so obsessed to watch me from another page or to watch me from YouTube. We are not friends. We are not cut from the same area. We are not just because we have the same skin color. We are not built the same and we are not the same. Understand that. And I make myself huh, very clear. As I say again, I'm not bothered by your comments. <laughs> Look where it got me at today. Um, anyway, so my show is coming out um, in September. So I want you guys to definitely plan on coming to St. Louis. Book your flights. Book your hotels. Uh, we all have some good restaurants around. Uh, everybody, <laughs> somebody asked yesterday, y'all. Yeah, tell me if this. <laughs> tell me if this funny. They said, well, Andrew, are you going to feed the audience? Um, uh, no. <laughs> what do I look like feeding them? I love them. I was like, um, I was like, uh, <coughs> when I said, I've been on shows and Wendy Williams didn't feed me. Uh, no. My somebody said the neck, honey. Look, the neck, the neck. Um, I said, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't get no chicken. <laughs> Sit back, enjoy yourselves, and after <laughs> and after um, the show is over, you go petulize those other restaurants, you know, in, in the area or around St. Louis. <laughs> um, but I am so excited. You guys hold this to my heart. Hold this. Hold this against me. And if I'm lying, I'm saying this now. Do not support me again. How about that? But my show is coming out in september this is a live audience that means i will meet you guys in person every day every, i believe we're going to be shooting for a while um i haven't got shooting dates or um none of that this is a live it's going to be live it's going to be all that i am so excited I know I got people lurking me from other pages, so I'm repeating myself because I, I wanted to get in your spirit. And for those that think I'm lying, I want this to be hold to a high standard. So I'm saying this again. Your boy, Andrew Caldwell, who, who don't have to pay anything, is coming out with his own show. Um, I wish I can hire Mar Marco. Marco does um, Wendy. Um, not, he used to work for Wendy Williams, who is my who is my friend. Um, he used to work for Wendy Williams. Um, that's Demar Mari. And now he works for Sherry Shepard, who is my friend. She followed me. Um, Sherry Shepard knows I love her. Uh, Sherry, I did see yesterday um, your um, studio, your platform, your set. I recognize a lot of things on your set, girl. Um, but uh, no, I'm not coming out with no show with Sherry Shepard. Let me correctly it up now. No, I'm just talking in general because you know it's some lies. People, people just sit up and hate. They have hate in that, but they see why. If I meet them in person, I wouldn't even acknowledge them. Um, but um, hey, ABC Seven. Hey, Robert. Ah! Hi. How are you? Uh, but I want you guys uh, to be ready. My show is coming out in September. Book your flights. Book your hotels. Um, do whatever you have to do um, because I look forward to seeing you. And I want to say this once again. I can't thank them enough. Thank you to NBC. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you to the naysayers. Um, thank you to my... Y'all Y'all better thank God for y'all Judas. I don't know. I, I, I don't know who I'm talking to. But you better thank God for your haters. You better thank God for those that hate on you. Because we will not be where we at today and if it wasn't for our haters. So you better you better go ahead and thank God for your haters now. For your Judas. Because they're going to see me eating shrimps. They're going to see me eating lobsters. They're going to see me eating everything that's out there. Because I thank God for my Judas. Mm -hmm. Y'all better thank God. Come on, y'all. Come on in the comments. Y'all better thank God for y'all Judas. You better thank God for your haters. I tell people I wouldn't have and live the way I live if it wasn't for my Judas. You better come on and thank God because they going to see me living on top of the world. They going to see me eating shrimp, lobster. They going to see me eating emos, pizza. Uh, they going to see me eat, eat Domino's, uh, Chinese food. Honey, they going to even see me walking around. 
You better thank God for your Judas. Because if it had not been for the Lord who was on my side, where would I be? And I thank God for the church of God in Christ. And I thank God for those that's calling themselves Christians. Holy and die. Sitting around, tooting that booty up. Sitting around, talking about the saints of God. Sitting around, making a mockery of God. I thank God for you. Because I wouldn't be where I'm at if it wasn't for you. And I thank God for you, lie for those that constantly lie on me, make up things, those that sit around on YouTube. I'm having a moment right now. Thank you. I don't even look at the YouTube videos no more. I said, don't you send me that devil. Don't you send me that foolishness. I don't have time to entertain that foolishness. Y'all better stop entertaining those foolishness. I'm telling y'all, that stuff get in your spirit. And that stuff can hinder you. And it can hinder your blessings. That's why you got to watch. Mama said you got to watch who's coming to your house. You got to watch who shake your hand. You got to watch who you prophesy to. You got to watch who you eat at, who eats at your table. I don't shake everybody's hand. And I don't give a damn if you was the president. I ain't shaking your hand. And I don't care if you was the richest black man in St. Louis. I'm not shaking your hand if your spirit ain't right. Come on and give God some praise. Guess who's coming for dinner? Look at you. And I thank God for them. I won't be driving my Porsche, my Bentley. I won't be driving my Maserati. I won't be driving my Mercedes. Those are material things. Those can come and go. But I thank God that I came and go. Hey, hey, take out of both seat. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thank God. I thank God. I'm not cursing. It just came out. Told you, I'm just having a little moment. Because I remember when being homeless, I remember going to Starbucks, watching the deal shop, talk about, 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 see. I did that. Washing underneath my arms. I remember those days. I remember those days sitting on live, trying to love those and those devils and ignorance and whores and prostitutes would sit up on my live. And the whole time, I'm thinking they like me. And the whole time, those folks been trying to pray against me. Teamed up. Try to start their own stuff. And guess what? No weapon from against me shall prosper. <laughs> what? The, the, uh, it probably formed, but it didn't prosper. <laughs> it probably formed, but it didn't prosper. Come on, somebody. <laughs> Come on, somebody in the comments. <laughs> Everything that the devil tried, but it didn't work. <laughs> Calling the people on me ain't work. They ain't, ain't got nobody knocking at my door. <laughs> Filing false reports. <laughs> All I got to do is get my, my rich lawyers. I know how to pay my way up. <laughs> Been doing it and will continue to do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> you laugh, you mad, <laughs> you mad, <laughs> ah! you mad, baby, I'm not bothered by y'all comments, at all, I ain't bothered by your comment, sweetie, you want me to sit around and, uh, and be mad or be angry over a comment that I, I don't know you, child, Frost, I know you might be in Russia. You might be in Palestine. I don't know where you at, child. As far as I know, you might not even be a real person. So what I look like going back and forth with you in your car? I ain't working with nobody today. Mm -mm, I might do it tomorrow once I'm bored. As a matter of fact, tomorrow's Saturday. I got a whole full day. As a matter of fact, I got to go get my suit ready. Because I got to go to...